Aboriginal land. So uh, why don't you why don't you give yours start, back? We'll also acknowledge the trade union values that we bring to the work that we do and to the rally today. We are union. We stand united as part of a great movement of workers. Our diversity is our strength. Our solidarity is our power. We respect and take care of each other. Prejudice and discrimination, including misogyny, racism, homophobia and all other hatreds have no place in our movement. We rise together. Today and every day we commit ourselves to achieving justice, fairness, equality and dignity for all workers. Solidarity forever! Too bad for uh, all right, citizens who to kick off Russell this rally. Today, so, uh, I'd like to welcome rights, uh, the Secretary of the Victorian Trades Hall Council. Please welcome Luke Kilakari. Look at you all here today, comrades. Aren't we a big crowd? <laughs> I think Melbourne is a the union comrades, town. The comrades, the comrades. There we go. So when I say union, you say power. Union! 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 When I say union, you say power! Union! 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 That's right, comrades. Today we're going to show Scott Morrison Get him when what the union power looks like, aren't we? Because we want him to call an election. Do we want him to call an election? And that's I, I think he is going to call our workplaces are fundamentally broken. How could it be that we have people in insecure work? 40% of Australians, when you're in insecure work, you can't go to the bank and ask for a loan for a house. When you're in insecure work, you can't guarantee that you can go to your sons or your daughters football match. When you're in insecure work, you don't know what chance you're working day in, day out. Comrades, is that fair? We have a big sector of the population who are waiting for a pay rise. We've seen profits skyrocket. We've seen our own productivity <laughs> skyrocket. At the same time, our own supply line. Get them while they're young. There, uh, there may be some people in the community who uh, would regard brainwashing little kids as child abuse, but uh, that's a matter of interpretation. Is that fair? And that's why we're marching today, comrades. All of us, we've also today the Premier of Victoria, Daniel Andrews. We are one big family. It's you, it's the Labor, it's all the Labor Party people. We've got some Greens marching with us too. We're pleased to have them. We've also got the Bananas in Pyjamas. It's a good rally that we're showing up, isn't it? So, to pander to the we've kids. Got a <laughs> we all Brainwashing the law. We're all watching us today. So I'm going to invite the cameras to turn around and face you and I'm going to ask you a few questions. So, let me ask you, crowd. Is it fair that corporate profits have gone sky high while our wages are so low? Is it fair that 40% of workers are in insecure work? Is it fair that our biggest companies pay no tax? Is it fair that the ABCC harasses and threatens Australian workers? Or that Scott Morrison has underfunded our schools, underfunded our hospitals, has not introduced ratios into nursing homes? or has ended penalty rates for 700,000 Australians or have SO workers have been on strike for 622 days. Well, we don't think it's fair either, comrades, and that's why we're taking some action. So we want Scott Morrison now to face us, to face all of us at the ballot box. So I'm going to put out a chair. I'm going to say, what do you want? You're all going to say an election, and then I'm going to say, when do you want it? You're going to say... What do we want? When do we want it? What do we want? When do we want it? What do we want? When do we want it? Do you think he heard us, comrades? I think he did. The good news, comrades, is that people like Scott Morrison have to face us. The good news is that we're in a democracy. And if we don't like him, we can get rid of him. 
Are we going to get rid of Scott Morrison? Yes. How about Peter Dutton? Yes. How about Mateo Cash? How about Tony Abbott? Are we going to get this done, comrades? Well done on turning up. It's a big rally. It's our moment. We're going to change the rules. All right, comrades, a quick chance. I'm going to say every background, every age. And you're going to say, we demand a living wage. Are you ready? Seriously, come on. Are you ready? Are you ready? Every background, every age. We demand a living wage. Every background, every age. Every background, every age. Every background, every age. All right. I'd like to welcome up our second speaker. Please welcome her, the State Secretary of the, Victor of the Australian Nursing and Midwifery Federation, Lisa McFatrick. Thank you very much, Phil. Amazing. And, uh, can 